day everyone. Today, you will learn division of polynomials using synthetic division. Example number one. Divide 3x cubed plus 2x minus 4 by x minus 1 using synthetic division. So 3x cubed plus 2x minus 4 is the dividend and x minus 1 is the divisor. First, write the dividend in standard form and insert zeros as coefficients of any missing term. Both dividend and divisor must be in standard form. So, the dividend 3x cubed plus 2x minus 4, that becomes 3x cubed plus 0x squared plus 2x minus 4. Then, equate the divisor x minus 1 to 0. That becomes x minus 1 equals 0. Then, take the additive inverse of negative 1, which is positive 1. So, you are going to add both sides by 1. That becomes x minus 1 plus 1 equals 0 plus 1. x minus 1 plus 1 is x. 0 plus 1 is 1. So, x equals 1. So, you are going to write it here. Then, take all the coefficients of the dividend. 3, 0, 2, negative 4. Then, bring down 3. Then, 3 times 1 is 3. You are going to write it here. Then, 0 plus 3 is 3. Then, 3 times 1 is 3. You're going to write it here. Then, 2 plus 3 is 5. Then, 5 times 1 is 5. You're going to write it here. Then, negative 4 plus 5 is 1. So, 1 is the remainder. So, the coefficients now are 3, 3, 5, and 1. So, this becomes the, co the coefficients of your quotient. So, to write the quotient, in our uh, dividend, the degree is 3. So, you're going to subtract 1. That becomes 2. So, 3x squared plus 3x plus 5 plus 1 over x minus 1. So, therefore... 3x cubed plus 2x minus 4 divided by x minus 1 is equal to 3x squared plus 3x plus 5 plus 1 over x minus 1. Example number 2. Divide 2x cubed minus x squared plus 2x plus 14 by 2x plus 3 using synthetic division. First, Write the dividend in standard form and insert zeros as coefficients of any missing term. Both dividend and divisor should be in standard form. So we notice that the given is already in standard form and there is no missing term. So you're going to write it here. 2x cubed minus x squared plus 2x, plus 14. Then, equate the divisor to 0. That becomes 2x plus 3 equals 0. Then, take the additive inverse of 3, which is negative 3. So, you're going to subtract both sides by 3. That becomes 2x plus 3 minus 3 equals 0 minus 3. 3 minus 3 is 0. That becomes 2x. 0 minus 3 is negative 3. So we have 2x equals negative 3. Divide both sides by 2. So 2 divided by 2 is 1. So 
it becomes x. Then, x equals negative 3 over 2. You're going to write it here. Negative 3 over 2. Then, take all the coefficients of the dividend. 2, negative 1, 2, and 14. Then, bring down 2. Then, 2 times negative 3 is negative 6. Divide by 2 is negative 3. You're going to write it here. Negative 3. Negative 1 plus negative 3 is negative 4. Then, negative 4 times negative 3 is positive 12. Divide by 2, that is 6. You're going to write it here. Then, 2 plus 6 is 8. Then, 8 times negative 3 is negative 24. Divide by 2, that is negative 12. You're going to write it here. Then, 14 plus negative 12 is 2. So, the remainder is... 2. So these are the coefficients now. 2, negative 4, 8, and 2. Since the value of x is a fraction, negative 3 over 2, you're going to divide the coefficients except the remainder by the denominator, which is 2. So 2 divided by 2 is 1. Negative 4 divided by 2 is negative 2. 8 Divided by 2 is 4. Okay, the degree is 3, so minus 1. So we have x squared minus 2x plus 4 plus the remainder 2 over 2x plus 3. Therefore, 2x cubed minus x squared plus 2x plus 14 divided by 2x plus 3 is equal to x squared minus 2x plus 4 plus 2 over 2x plus 3. So that is how we divide polynomials using synthetic division. Thank you so much.